Hey guys, it is Super Smash Productions here, and today I have a new plush I want to show you, and it is Tom. Tom. You know, the guy who we all think is Thomas Connor. Yeah, anyways. So yeah, here is my Tom plush that I have recently finished. I m finished him, uh, yesterday, or actually two days ago. And, um, well, by the time I'm recording this, it was yesterday, by the time this is uploaded... It's gonna be two days ago. So, anyways, um, yeah. So this is Tom. He's actually very cool. I like his um nostril, his nose. I mean, so I think I did. Everyone likes this Boris better because it looks better. Only thing is that, honestly, I have to agree that the muzzle does look a lot more. The face looks more accurate. Instead of material, I actually painted the blush on, but it's kind of messy. This side's beautiful. That side's messy. The eyes were sewn on, so basically all the black thin pieces were painted on, like the arm. So the arm was actually pretty cool. I just got a strap of material right there, and then some gray, like the action figure has some gray for the belt, and then right there, and then right here, it's just um, it's just the bendy arm. So yeah, that's cool. I like him. He's very cool. He's also very big. He has bigger shoes than Boris, my Boris plushie. Yeah, and he's also, because he, he's just very cool. I like him. I'm planning on making Allison as well, but at the same time, I don't think I'll be able to. All right, so I just reviewed everything, so I'm just going to get to the smaller details. So basically, I had to copy um, what I had off my original Boris plush off of the, um, off of, um, onto this. So, yeah, the eyes are not glued on. They're actually sewn on. To this piece before it was before the face was sewn onto the sock. So whenever I make a Boris plush, I always may use a sock for the head and the body because it seems easier. And also, fun fact about my Boris plushies, I don't add legs in the blackness because you're not gonna see them. So what's the point of putting them? So I just cut out the leg pieces. So if you're wondering why it looks so nice, that's because he has no legs. It's just the piece of material stuffed so yeah that's um tom he's very cool i'm gonna compare next to boris right now so yeah um we have boris next to tom and as you can see there's a drastic difference he has way bigger shoes and he's not dirty because well this one's old and um oh you know what? i almost forgot i forgot about his buttons so that's what i am missing on tom yeah i, I forgot his what i dang it so yeah and also, um, basically how I was made the arm, it's basically just one arm except the glove, and then, um, I just stuck this on, and then I just sewed around the arm right there, and then that's how it was made. Yeah, Boris is very dirty, you can't really tell, but he's very dirty. <coughs> Sorry, my voice. He looks a lot more friendlier, unlike you, Mr. <laughs> just kidding. So yeah, and he also has bigger ears, and he has smaller ears, which is more accurate. So yeah, he's a lot more stiffer, and... Unlike this fella with the very wobbly neck. That's cool. Okay. Anyway, so yeah, that's that's Tom next to Boris. And the reason why I made Tom is because of an upcoming video. To celebrate um, Boris in the Dark Survival, I'm just... I'm not celebrating it, but like... <clears throat> it's a new game, so I just wanted to make a video of it. So I'm going to be making a Boris in the Dark Survival video soon with CJ. I'm going to be voicing Tom, and he's going to be voicing Tom... Uh, Boris so yeah look look forward to that coming soon they're, they're kissing it's weird so yeah look forward to that coming soon and uh, that's Boris and Tom and thank you for watching and goodbye